assignment for midterm examination preparation there are 10 questions here i'll have another two videos for the rest of the questions for your preparation first is you have to open a new file in excel that is opening clicking on the excel and there may be difference between what i'm showing here and your own things because i'm using 2019 version of excel you may have access to 2016 version and if it's something earlier to 2016 don't use that machine because your syllabus says it is 2016 version that needs to be that you need to be trained upon so get a pc where the 2016 version is i have a 2019 version the first open a new file if you do not know how to do it just click on the excel icon then first screen itself is comes is either it's a open a file or a new file you have to choose a new file and that file has to be saved on your name i already saved it and that saving is done by save as and you choose your name for saving as and in my case i already done it so it is my same is saved here then it says name the sheet here the sheet default name will be sheet one if you double click on that you'll get that selection and instead of sheet one type your second name or any other name if you don't have second name choose any other name so that you remember that you are named that sheet as that particular by name. So that takes care of the first question. Next he says, select the entire worksheet. Selection entire worksheet is clicking on this corner. And then row height and column height. You go to home and there is a format. You go to home. Format here, row height and column width are there. The first cell select like the row height. It may be something different in your case, 8.75 or something. Make it 20. Similarly, go home, format, column width. I'll change it to come to 20, maybe 15 in your case. So change it to 20. So now my row heights and for and these 20 means they are 20 pixels. And pixels are they refer to the resolution of the computer. How many picture cells? Write a title to the sheet from B1 to D1. So B1 is here, C1 is here, D1 is here. So I'll write me write in capitals. Headings, it is in capitals. So my examination. So it is capital letters. My Examination oh. and it has to be centered along this one. So I'd come, I'd select B, C, D, right click, format cells, and center across selection. I was not showing any difference because I already done it once. That's why it's showing. And then it says bold aerial font size. 18 it has to be bold so let me go to home make it bold then font style i want it to be arial then i want it to be size 18 and if it is not fitting there i can increase the size of the row the row height now it is fitting it's uh, done, make it bold, aerial font size. Now this has been green color now. So home, my color has to be green. Now it is not coming because I not selected that because this text is here. Though it's seen here, but actually it is here. But when you come here, it shows blank. Come here, it comes shows blank. There was a text entered here, but it is centered across these three things. Home and make it green. That takes care of this question. Center the between B and use merge. Do not use merge and center. We are not done that. Then write a column heading for column A in cell A1 as over time charges. So here I do double click on this and I say over, over time. Are just 
Next, let me make it work. My mistake. Let me undo this mistake. And undoing is done by either using this button or Control Z. So I take I give on the demonstration of control. So over time should I come here now? Over time charges is a heading I'm giving to this. I'm going to enter some data here. Populate a cell from A2 to A21. That is A2 to A21. A21. What is that I want to put? I want to put a random number between 100 to 99. So you put it is equal to rand. When I say rand, you'll get something rand between also as choice. Then it says, okay, from where to where. So I want from 100. I want three digit numbers. 999. Now, if I press enter, it will only populate here. So I have to press, put it there and control enter. The entire selection. So 20 numbers. So I'll leave it here as it is because each one is a random number. Every time I press any key, these numbers will change. So first I have to copy this. Right click copy, then right click a special and values and say okay. So now even if I press any key, these numbers will change, will not change. Where I would have changed. So I have populated the cell from A2 to A21 with random numbers from 100 to 999. I've <laughs> done copy, paste, paste special. These are the random numbers so they don't change with the key press. Put a comment in A10 saying this data is doubtful. A10 become here. Right click, I get insert comment. Instead, what is that put? I had to put this data outful. So comes as a comment there and enter. Whenever I come here, this pops up. Hide column from F to H. F to H F is where F is here. So F to H. Hide columns. Hide. So my data is also gone. So in case I want to see the data, I have to unhide. So unhide. You have to edge. So I have to select this one and then I say unhide. And rows from 20 to 30. 20 to 30. If I hide for so 20 to 30, if I have to hide, Hide my data. Is, do not want that to happen. So you to undo this way or use Control Z. Both are same. So I hidden and unhidden. Write the numbers maximum and minimum. Now I have to find out in this one. What is the, let us say, is equal to max out of this entire thing, max out of this entire thing. So here, this is the max, maximum among this is, now I want to find minimum. And for that, the formula is, is equal to min again the data is from 21 to 2 here so maximum has come minimum has come write the columns write maximum and minimum find the sum of all the numbers which are greater than 500 now sum of all numbers we want to find out sum of all numbers, all numbers greater than 500. 
greater than it's not greater than equal to only greater than in 500 is not included in that greater than 500 the formula for that is is equal to sum sum if press sum if you can use this one sum if range that is from where to where uh, my numbers are from here to here four time charges up to here is my data criteria criteria that i want is greater than 500 and some range same thing up to Press OK. So 7973 is the sum of all those numbers which are greater than 500. And you want to see what is the formula here at every place. So we can use another formula for getting the formula of the formula. Formula text. The formula here shows. And then you can drag it down to show what is the formula in the next cell. And drag it down so it will go down one is sum if so that takes care of find the sum of all the numbers which are greater than 500 find the sum of all numbers less than 200 sum of all numbers sum all numbers less than 200 so I'd make a formula of all that so is equal to again sum if from here, range, range is here, up to one, criteria is less than 200, sorry, is less than 200, and how did that you want to sum? I'm this one. Less than 200, I think there are no numbers. Let me choose less than 300, maybe. So I'll change the question also accordingly. Less than 300. I'll change the question 300. So it is not less than 200, less than 300. Less than 200 is coming to zero. So I'll change the question also accordingly. Find the sum of all numbers. 300. Tenth is find the sum of all numbers. Uh, tenth is done. So we have, and let me see the, what is the formula here. Not this is not seen properly, but double clicking on this one will expand the column width. So that entire thing fits in there. Now to say that, you know, this is data, let me color this data with some, I'll make a uh, home and I'll color this with, so that this is data. And maybe I can put borders, all of it, all borders. So the data looks separate then. And these are the ones we have computed right now. Other color to that, put a different color, then I'll also put border to that better visibility. Now, this also not putting in the column. So, let me now finish the first 10 questions. So, practice with the data that you have to create and this 10 questions. I don't think it will take more than 10 minutes. Let me see how many minutes I recorded. Is that much only? And I can't slow. 